businesses and interdisciplinary performance for World Press Freedom Day, International Day of Dance. We're going to have music, spoken word, dance, and painting. We're going to encourage and advocate for freedom of press, media, and more importantly, freedom of expression. Freedom of press, media, today is in its most endangered time since the invention of the printing press. Let's not kid ourselves about this. It's not just Serbia or Russia or third world dictatorships where freedom of expression is endangered. It's the so-called free democracies where freedom and expression of media is also endangered. There's really no free press in most countries. The media is concentrated by a handful of corporate conglomerates. The danger of limited press freedom and expression comes more from private corporations than it does from the state. In the USA since 1996, the entire media is controlled by five corporations, and that is shrinking. In Western continental Europe, the German media corporation Bertelsmann controls 90% of private media outlets. Germany, France, Netherlands, Italy, Denmark is all controlled the private media by Bertelsmann. And there's a clear and obvious corollary between corporate interests and government. A couple of years ago, Dr. Udo Kukota, the former editor of the Frankfurter Allgemeine Zeitung, Germany's leading newspaper, wrote a book called What? Journalist. And in it, he published a book which he says that the CIA and the German Secret Service fraud journalists and editors to write pieces, articles, reports, opinion pieces that have no basis in fact, but are just propaganda for NATO. The BBC World Service, which you get outside of the UK, is not an independent media service. In fact, the BBC, the BBC is actually controlled by the British Foreign Office. So therefore, when you listen to BBC Radio or BBC World News, you're not getting independent media. No, in fact, you're getting what the British government wants you to know. Yes. We must oppose this. And so I'm going to dedicate today and this performance to Julian Assange, Chelsea Manning, Edward Snowden, and these are the most courageous whistleblowers and journalists today. And they're being tortured. And the media wants them, the governments want them to put them away. Here we go. Sixty-six. I'm introducing Emily right here, so this is my love of my life. Make sure I got the beats right, and here we go. Just put that away. Reactionary anthem. That's number sixty-six.
future to press freedom, of course. And the internet has brought many things and has connected the world and has really uh, expanded information. But I'm worried about this 5G and I'm worried about the expansion of the so-called internet of things. And you already see the dangers of it in China. Right now in China they have what's called uh, social credit and they follow you on the internet and if you do not uh, conform then you cannot travel, you cannot go on a train, you cannot get a job. It's pretty smart, isn't it?
What happens when I'm present and tortured? Then I find myself in hell. What happens in hell? I lose my mind. When I lose my mind, I'm no longer conscious. When I lose my consciousness, I'm a useless human. What becomes of the useless human? I possess a waiting ticket to nowhere, to nowhere, to nowhere. How goes the trip to nowhere? It leads to slavery. What is slavery? Dehumanization. What's dehumanization? Losing my soul. What happens when I lose my soul? I have nothing left to live for. When I have nothing left to live for, then all options have run out. When all options have expired, then there's nothing left for me. Thank you. Thank you. What you must realize as well is that, and, I, and I'm only going back to 18, 1898, the media is responsible for the deaths of no less than 100 million people in the world. Before every trigger is pulled, before every bullet is fired, before every bomb is dropped, before every missile is launched, it is organized by the media. Yes? World War I, Europeans were whipped into a frenzy and hysteria because of the media. Even World War II is the cause of the media. Did you know that in 1930s, Hitler received nothing but endless praise and coverage, and coverage from the Western media? Yes, the Western media is also responsible for World War II. The Western media, the media in general, not just the Western media, the media in general demonizes racial and ethnic minorities and immigrants, and it's nothing but filth. And this song is about the filth that's promoted by the media. Here we go. Directions. Missiles are launched. Patriots have sex with the flag. Dissidents are called stupid fags. Pledge allegiance to the big boss man. The men that live behind the hog. The ones down south outside Atlanta. And the county called Cobb. Colonel Sanders fries the doves. Barbecue, spare tires, good year for rubber stamps. Bouncing checks, all cheeks of asses. Ain't no anus, retain shit, not suitable for steel. Mid earth Florida houses of petty quarrels. Incident planets of testosterone. All praise and glory to St. Kong. Thank you, St. Kong, for leaving a mess. Thank you, St. Kong, for making life stinky. We give praise to St. Kong for the meal of trippy running eggs. We give praise to God, that same tongue is white. We give praise that same tongue provides the discharge of 
correct dicks and launch missiles. More white dicks they come to fuck the world. To fuck the world. Amen. 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 All right, so since this is the IRT logo and I'm not doing a full check of feature the show, I am coming to the end of my set and Gordana will be following me. Uh, but I have one more thing to say and you notice that they wanted to, you can't have graffiti, you can't write on the trains, you can't write on the walls. But there's freedom of expression and freedom of media for corporations, but not for artists. And this song is about that. From Soho to Oslo, from Town Square to Leicester Square, posters and bulletins, adverts and neons. We are bombarded by these strange sights. Sites to amuse us, sites to confuse us, posters and bulletins, adverts and neons. Drink your coke, money that's a joke, some old arts advice, but party and ice, posters and bulletins, adverts and neons. Lies and assumption, catch our perception, you've got merit, so use our credit says posters and bulletins. Adverts and neons. Calvin Klein, obsessions for Kate with fashion design from sex abstinence. Lust and pleasure, apparel for leisure. Brought to you by posters and bulletins. Adverts and neons. Posters and bulletins. Adverts and neons. Now they follow us on the ground. McDonald's, they allow to sell for the pounds. Do your share, so pay your fare. Us do not test or face or rest. Warns posters and bulletins, adverts and neons. Wanna keep it? You all the fucking club it. Fear and crime to occupy our time. See the police state incarcerate. Watch the dog police. Promote the daily peace. Hate your complexion. Change your profession. See Fruitopia. Disguise dystopia. Posters and bulletins. Adverts and neons. Wear your condoms. Test for AIDS. Buy our tampons. Be very afraid. For your health, we create our wealth. For your health, we create our wealth. You cannot escape, except in your blind. Posters and bulletins will haunt you forever. Adverts and neons will taunt you forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And, ever. and now comes the lovely and talented Bertan Azicic. My lovely, my lovely colleague for tonight. Take it away.
Hvala vam puno što ste došli. Ovo je kraj. Ako želite da podržite ovu nezavisnu produkciju, ovde vam je šešić za donacije.